Hey guys, my name is Gavin B. I'm a golf expert at Curated, and today I'm reviewing this Rixon ZX5 irons. First off, I want to say that I am not sponsored by any of these brands. These are my personal opinions on these irons. I would say it's one of the best in the market right now. When you hit this forged iron, you really don't feel the ball come off of it. It feels so smooth. These ZX5 irons are definitely going to be a little bit of a player's distance iron, but also have some qualities of a pure player's iron. So basically a player's distance iron is going to give you a lot of forgiveness if you don't hit at the center of the club face every time. It's going to give you more of that player's feel because you look down at the top line and it's not that thick. You get a forged iron so when you hit it pure it's going to feel just like a player's iron. It's going to come off the face hot. It's going to feel really good. You are going to have a tendency to hit them a little bit further especially because they're actually degree down and loft. So what your conventional five iron might be, you might hit this 10 to 15 yards longer because of the one degree loft difference. The total forged body just looks amazing. You can tell it's not cheap, it's just solid construction. And you have this nice little back plate and there's a tungsten weight actually on the toe to help with the MOI. So the total forged body, what that is, is they're casting one entire piece of metal and forging it into this shape. So a lot of other companies are gonna take two or three pieces and glue them together and that's how you're gonna get your irons. The difference between these, they're gonna feel way more solid, they're gonna feel way more pure when you hit it good. The ball is gonna come off the face just a lot more hot. These irons are one of the best in the market when it comes to spin. Coming off the club, it creates a lot of spin. You're gonna get that loft that you're looking for and that's gonna allow you to stick the ball on the greens even with the longer irons in the bag. So the four and the five iron, you're gonna be able to get them up in the air. They're gonna have that spin, they're gonna come down soft and you're gonna be able to stick them right on the pin. Some weaknesses come in. If you're a high handicapper golfer that is gonna have trouble, these are a little bit smaller of a club face. So it is gonna require some skill to hit. So these ZX5 irons, they're not the most workable because you're in that player's distance category. So they're meant to you know, help aid golfers trying to hit the ball straight. But if you want to put a little draw or cut on there, you absolutely can. I would recommend this club to a lot of mid handicappers. If you're a high handicapper, but you feel confident in your ball striking ability, I think this is definitely the club for you. I wouldn't recommend this iron for players just starting. Even your low, low handicappers, almost scratch golfers that are looking to play draws, fades, cuts. I think I would recommend going up to the Srixon ZX7s. If you would like to connect with me and chat about which clubs works for your needs, visit curated.com or text me at 628-267-3135.